All right, people, what's up, everyone, and welcome to another reaction video for today. And I'm here to take a look at that new trailer for Avatar The Way of Water, which, of course, comes out in like three weeks, maybe three and a half weeks. Yeah, I guess this this Thursday or Friday would be about three weeks, right? One, two, carry the three, five, six. Yeah, something like that. Anyway, so this trailer came out a couple hours ago. That's why I'm, I'm posting this so late. For, totally forgot it was going to happen. I knew it was going to premiere during um, like some football thing but or basketball or something. I knew it was, it was showing at some sports thing. Uh, I think it was at sports. I, I knew it was pro premiere tonight. And I totally forgot about it. Um, but I'm here to watch it now. So this is the new trailer. My guess, this is probably the final trailer. But uh, anyway, let's go. Three, two, this is my guess. So, I'm, I'm guessing we're not going to see too much here. <laughs> Excuse me, by the way. Let's go. Three, two, one, and play. I'm so ready. Take me. Take me, Jim. Take me, Jim. Why do you come to us? I just want to keep my family safe. Yes. Actually, I see. I saw some people say this, these special effects Treat are, are terrible. Treat them brothers and sisters. I was blown away when I heard that. I was like, really? Teach them our ways. Keep up for us, boy. If you want to live here, you have to ride. Let's do it. <laughs> Just breathe. Breathe. I'm down if this most of this movie is just like with the family. Like learning and stuff and bonding. And then, and then of course they have the military stuff. Oh, I love that shot. Yes, that's all they see. I see. Dude, 13 years. <laughs> a generation. It took a generation for them to come out. I like you. We're supposed to fight. Yeah. People. That looks so good. Stephen Lang. Let's get it done. Let's go. Should have just said, let's go. Let's go. This is definitely. Uh, this is definitely. This is like. This is final trailer written all over it. I see Avatar, a lot. Of, the oh. way of water. Experience it in 3D. Oh, yeah. Uh, IMAX Only 3D. Only Peters, December uh, 16th. Th just three. IMAX 3D. Uh, excuse me? Tickets on sale now. I already knew that. Um, oh, God. It's so good. It's so good. That was definitely like, I. It, if you watch a lot of trailers like me, you, you could pinpoint a final trailer. Like the one that just wants to, doesn't spoil too much of the story, but wants to show you as much as possible. You know, like, here's some action, here's some family, here's some, everything that you expect from this movie, it wants to show you it without spoilers. Just images, pretty much. It looks so good. I can't believe I, I saw some people say the special effects are bad. I don't want to call anybody out. There's one channel in particular that has some of the worst takes. I, I I'm not gonna say the names. Um, some of the worst takes. Used to be a huge fan of this channel, and and they went to shit. Um, but uh, I, I want to say the name so bad because I, I don't really like these people. They're kind of well, this one particular person, uh, j j massive dick. If, if anybody wants to know, maybe maybe uh. You know, message me on Twitter or something, I'll say. But, uh, I, I don't want to call him out. But, um, yeah, I, I shouldn't do that. No, don't message me. I won't, I won't tell you. But, uh, yeah, just like saying the, the special effect. Oh, just bad, oh, bad CG. Oh, I'm like, really? That's bad. That's bad CG. That. Of all the things we've seen, that's the one. Good Lord. Holy shit. <laughs> it, like, is, is it the most realistic? No, but like, they are also like, Big eyed, like anime ish, like freaking blue cat, like nine feet lady D fucking uh aliens. I don't know, like it looked, it looks great, they look perfect for the environment. And I like that there's barely any humans, like, I love that. You know, we've seen we see a couple here and there, obviously, the flamethrower guy. We're gonna see humans, you know, and then Giovanni Urbisi's coming back, which you know, his, his villain was so good in the last one. Um, the Paul Riser of that fucking movie, um. 
<clears throat> but and Stephen Lang's back, but he's not here. He's an avatar, which I I, I think I'm gonna assume they explain that. <laughs> I, well, yeah, of course they have to. I just are they gonna just say like we use one of the avatars and we somehow swapped his consciousness? I mean, I guess they do that anyway. But like, I have to watch Avatar one again. Do they explain like if he die? Yeah, doesn't he say like if you die, if your body dies and your avatar dies also? So and that's the big thing at the end of the. The first movie is that the the um, Navi like do like some spiritual thing. I don't know. This is this is me doing spiritual shit. Oh, <laughs> um, and and transfer his consciousness to the actual avatar permanently. Uh, and that's a, that's the, I remember the ending of the movie. It's been like maybe almost ten years since I watched it. Uh, where it's just like it's the close up of his avatar uh, face or his uh, Navi avatar face. That's what an avatar is. It's just, uh, and he like opens his eyes over. Right, I think so. Anyway, great trailer. I don't want to watch it again, though. Um, was it in 4K? No. Okay. Save that for the theater. Oh. I will say, watching this in 4K is amazing. Not not this trailer. The first trailer. Uh, someone posted... No, I'm sorry. The IMAX trailer. Someone actually put up the IMAX trailer to watch. And, oh my god. Like, I think it was actually the IMAX channel. Uh, but they put it up somewhere, and it was like a four and a half gigabyte download. It was a two minute, two and a half minute trailer, four and a half gigabytes, I think, or maybe, maybe it was a lot of gigabytes. It was at least three. Um, and it was, it was gorgeous. I watched it on my fucking, my OLED. I was like, <laughs> that is an instant buy. You not, you not, you better not stream that. You will lose in some quality. You got to buy that in 4k. Honestly, if you, if you go wait a couple months, maybe, and you don't want to watch it in theaters, then. Just spend that money you would on an, like an IMAX if you have a good home theater system. Just and you have an OLED TV like I do. Just buy, just buy the 4K. I mean, you won't get it in 3D. Uh, I think some, I think some 4K still come with 3D versions, right? <clears throat> so you might get it in 3D. So, eh, you should probably just see it in theaters. Honestly, if you're gonna see this movie, you might as well go big, right? Uh, I did read a news story before I watched this that uh, supposedly this movie needs to make. <laughs> This movie needs to make two billion dollars to be profitable. <laughs> I feel like the way they've been marketing this movie has not been the best. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like like I've seen more marketing for like I don't know, like Black Panther. I mean, Black Panther just came out though, so it makes sense that closer to release. But like, I, I thought I, I felt like I was seeing Black Panther ads months in advance it really did feel like that where this sh has to be bigger than black panther and it's coming out christmas it's gonna own christmas for sure but it's it, it feels like it's coming out the wrong i mean it, it's being advertised the wrong way uh, it should be like fucking everywhere and maybe maybe i'm just not noticing it but like i don't see it everywhere to be fair i don't watch a lot of, um uh tv so like regular tv so i don't know if commercials are on there i'm sure there's plenty of tv spots um but I don't see it anywhere, like, I don't know. Anyway. Uh, looks great. 